In 1610, Galileo published a treatise about the moon called Sidereus Nuncius. This was the first publication to be based on observations made through a telescope. The moon was no longer a perfect silvery orb. It had craters. It became something to explore. And this was the case in literature as much as in astronomy. The moon became a fashionable setting for utopian writing, a way of reflecting on society through imagining alternative worlds. Francis Godwin did this in The Man in the Moon, first published in 1638. His character, Gonzalez, takes flights with a supernatural breed of swan. Serrano de Bergerac also put a man on the moon in Selenaria, a satirical reflection on Parisian society from 1659. Remarkably, his protagonist is set off by a rocket, unknowingly anticipating future possibilities of space travel.